It's nice, isn't it? So good. What did you get? What is that? Una ciambella e un marocchino. Oh. Because apparently at this time of day I'm not allowed a cappuccino. Okay, Melanie, now that you've been here for two months, yes. what would you suggest or piece of advice you would give to tourists that would like to see visit Italy? There are a few things that you need to know. Ragazzi, don't panic if you get stopped by a police officer asking for your documenti. Just have your ID, have a driver's license or your passport ready. They just want to check. And it's not unusual, especially if they approach people with suitcases or large bits of luggage or backpacks and things like that. So as you can see, most of the shops will be closed around this time. They take a really long lunch break from around 1 till 4 p.m. Um, so all you'll see that are open are like restaurants and cafes. And of course, one pharmacy in the town, or at least one, will be open basically 24 seven. In general, we don't drink water for, from the tap here in Italy. Um, you either buy a bottled water or if your town or city has one of these then you can get a litre of water for just five cents. They have still and sparkling. And we're going to go for sparkling because apparently that's all Italians drink, right Dante? Yeah. Don't throw away your bottles. They will come in handy. If you're looking for some local good food, look for places with Osteria or Trattoria in the name, or if you fancy something a little bit more exotic, like say an Asian fusion restaurant with an all-you-can-eat buffet, which you can check out in our video. Um, you can eat really, really well for 15 euros per person. Drinks are excluded, but who doesn't love sushi? So trains are a fixed rate, which I absolutely love. There's no peak time, off peak time. Um, you can purchase your tickets at any time. Don't worry about purchasing them last minute because you're not going to pay any extra. Um, and the timetable is fixed for the whole year, um, except for maybe Sundays or bank holidays, but you'll see the little asterisks um, next to any of them that have any changes. Thank you. So you can purchase your train tickets at one of these booths or in the window. It's really straightforward. You purchase from station to station, town to town, uh, because this station and this town actually doesn't have a metro. So it's just trains um, kind of between cities. And once you've purchased it, don't forget to validate um, through this portal. Otherwise, you can purchase tickets on trenitalia.it. One thing I would say is always keep change or some cash on you. It's quite unusual in London um, to have cash to pay for your coffee, to pay for your you know, pastries and things. But here, these cafes are run by families and they are small businesses. So give them a bit of a help. Always carry cash because the coffees are super cheap. I mean, just a cafe, which is an espresso, is what, a euro? One euro stand. Mm. And last tip, guys, if you want to have the best pizza, try to find your city, town, or village a real Napolitan pizzeria. It's the best. Buon appetito.